Hands up, I'll put out an APB. MJ, hey. Just checking in. Peter, hey. Can I call you back? I think you'll want to hear this. Wait, why are you whispering? Just in the middle of something. How about we catch up over dinner? My place? Oh, sure. I'll even cook. Cool. See ya. Wait, remember how you told me about Lee's corrupting touch? I think I just saw it in action. How? Some perfectly nice homeless people just jumped me. Thing is, they had glowing eyes. And I remembered Yuri telling me something similar about the guard who released Shocker. So Shocker was working for Lee? Uh, it's all connected. There's more, but I guess we'll talk about it at dinner. Yeah, see ya. Dinner? <sighs> what should I cook? Oh, hi, Doctor. How are you? Parker! Exciting news. Come by the lab. Uh, like, now? This is my divining moment. Can't wait to show you. Cool. Um, I've got dinner plans. Can I come by later? Dinner can wait. You need to see this, Peter. Um, uh, okay. Uh, be right there. Wonder if this means I have a job again. Guess I can stop by. Just for a minute. Demons are down. Time for the bomb. Bad time to get sweaty palms. Disarmed. Thanks for that, Spider-Man. We'll take it from here. You got it, officer. Always ready to do my part. All units, pursuit in progress of mass terrorists believed to have a bomb. Please proceed to Chelsea ASAP. Friends, I've just received an update on Adrian Toomes, a.k.a. The Vulture. Apparently, this winged criminal has... Hey, Doctor. Hello, Peter. I'll be just a minute. Look at all this new stuff. We really need to get better about organizing our works. Where did you get all this equipment? Called in every last favor. Took out a few loans. It's like we're starting over once again. But this time's going to be different. You've been busy. Just getting started. You know, until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? Okay, I think that should do it.
Ready? Everything okay? Damn it! This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a... Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. I uh, have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction on my part. No, don't worry. Why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test. So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of changing the world just in different ways. Wait, you were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. <sighs> Add Corp to that and, well, it is a catchy name. Well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. He started a project I considered unethical. And there was this... Anyway, lawyers got involved. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. I'll brew some fresh coffee. Be sure to run a diagnostic on the control unit. Could be a short. Huh. No good. Gotta reroute this circuit.
Oh, why don't you do the honors this time? We did it. Next step, neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. Sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't found another job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? To changing the world. Call from MJ. Doctor, I need to go, but I'll be back later. Don't worry, the work will still be here when you get back. I could 3D print a web shooter. I can't believe it. What is this stuff, Doc? Looks like armored plating. Defense prototypes. Fascinating, really. AIM has requested a number of samples of my work. Who am I to deny them my genius? Ha! Kidding, of course. Doc's working on some kind of advanced hypodermic delivery system. Maybe to help with implant rejection? I don't know, that's a big needle. Wait, is this the raft? Are you doing work for the Supermax prison? Indeed. They're soliciting bids to modernize their security grid. Figured I'd try my hand. Lucrative contract, and a satisfyingly difficult nut to crack. Doc working on with this. Severed extremities, replicating the function of lost appendages. But what if instead we gave people something they've never seen? Something straight from the mind. Unchain all of us from the bodies we've been born with, and instead unleash the awesome power of our minds. Today is the day. Grant review. We're ready. The work has progressed at a remarkable pace. I honestly never thought we'd get the tensile actuator back to an acceptable tolerance. But Parker, the boy has an eye for guerrilla science like none other. Just as I was ready to order a custom machine replacement part, he returned from the hardware store with a bottle of solvent and a toothbrush. Bang, actuator problem resolved. The boy is a genius. <sighs> a chronically late genius. It's already 10 after. Where is he? Surely he couldn't have forgotten today's review. Sorry I let you down, Doc. Hey, sorry I missed your call. We still on for dinner? Dinner? Oh, yeah. I was calling you about something else, but 
Yeah, we should talk over dinner. Offer still stands for me to come over and cook. Oh, really? Well, I like to take risks. I'm still out, but I'll grab some stuff at the store and let you know when I'm home. Okay, talk soon. All right, dinner at MJ's. No expectations. You know what, just screw this one up. Guess I'll just freelance for a while until she calls. Boutonier. Crushed when I had to fight Fisk. That kind of symbolizes my luck with relationships. Another camera. Looks like Black Cat, all right. Oh, poor spider. I know I disappointed you when I couldn't go straight, but why mess with perfection? They sell rare wine here. She's branching out. Gotta try and get ahead of her.
No need to thank me, Sable dudes. Although it's kind of rude you didn't. You are not going to believe what happened. So you know that address you gave me? I went there. MJ. I know, I know, but wait. What is this? Just listen. This is the address Pete found. Men are all carrying firearms. What is this place? office. Might be something inside that connects this to Lee. Need to get back there. Huh? What was that? What dumbass can't put their shit away? Bet it was happy. Almost shot a rat. Need to get this guy out of my way. Martin Lee's really paying the boss? Yeah. We build this war beast for Lee. Lee finances the boss's new venture. Win. Yo, Rick! Boss wants to talk to you. Get in here. Well, you better clean your slime. Need to get into that office. Well. Boss sees that, he'll be pissed. So what's the boss doing with the money from this What are they building? Is this all for Lee? Tried any yet? What was that sound? Easy does it. What kind of vehicle needs tires this big? Where is it? I swear I left it over here. What is this? Some kind of military hardware? Office must be to my right. Need to move careful through here. Hey, anyone pick up more beer after our last run? Those barrels seem important. Alchemax. What's in these? Boss, come on! We'll never notice! Two 
Brimstone. You're right, Rick. Uh. Won't notice? Because uh. it won't be there. God damn it! I said I'll fix it! Ah! Ah! You got some stones, Rick. <laughs> Let's see if they break. Such a disappointment. And now I need a new welder. Blueprints. An APC. This is what they're building for Lee. But why does he need an armored f here? GPS trackers. What is Tombstone using these for? All right, boys. Time to move. Get the gear for my office. Time to go. Okay, I want to say don't ever do that again, but since I know you're going to anyway, here. Take a few of those next time. Nice. Thanks. You know Tombstone is crazy and pretty much invincible, right? Everybody has their weakness. Mine is... whatever you're cooking right now. <laughs> it smells amazing. The chicken curry. Uh, just needs some time to simmer. No dumplings, I hope. You're never gonna let me live that one down, are you? Nope. <laughs> the great dumpling catastrophe. I still can't believe they evacuated the entire building. I know, and in January, too. <laughs> Your neighbors hated me. Yeah, they were pretty happy when we broke up. <laughs> yeah. So, let's talk about what you found in Lee's office. Well, Lee clearly has issues with Norman Osborne. Yeah, but, but why? I don't know yet. But his next move looks like it involves Devil's Breath, whatever that is. Yeah, I'll dig into it. So I was thinking, what if we teamed up? What, what, you want to be my sidekick? Like a uh, spider girl? Spider woman. No. Woman. No, not a sidekick. A partner. Oh. Not again. Ah. Hey, it's your crime system thingy. Looks like a residential break-in. Charles Standish. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Oh! Oscorp CFO! Wait. You don't think this has anything to do with Lee, do you? Sorry to cook and run. Did... Did you just leave your clothes on the kitchen floor? Uh... Where do you want me to, uh... Just the couch is fine. <laughs> yeah. See you later? Yeah. Hey, it's me. This curry is legit. So what do we know about Charles Standish? Let's see. Chief Financial Officer at Oscorp. Single. Known for his art collection. If Lee's after him, it's gotta be related to Devil's Breath. I'll run a search on everything in that file. Let me know the second you find something. I think Lee might be planning something even worse than City Hall. So, are we partners now? Cause it sure feels like we are. Partners. Sounds good. Okay. 
See ya, partner. Today is a day for somber reflection, for mourning and honoring fallen heroes like Jefferson Davis. But it's also a day to vow never again. It stops here. Some people say I blame everything on Spider-Man. Well, I don't blame him for the bombing. That cowardly act is squarely the responsibility of whoever committed it. If we're gonna keep New York safe, no longer tolerate the kind of lawlessness Spider-Man and his ilk represent. This is our city. By God, we're going to take it back. Police look like they could use some help. Probably more of them inside. You guys stay here. Somebody was in a hurry. Spider Man! You're hurt. I'm okay. But you gotta find Mr. Standish. Fast. Those guys in the masks kidnapped him and forced him up to his place. He lives in the penthouse, top floor. Okay, sit tight. So glad you're here. I can't find my car. Could have sworn I parked on this level. Work here too? This building is serious about parking enforcement. Good fight. A for effort. Elevator won't work. They know I'm here. But maybe I can sneak up through the elevator shaft. 
Should be able to make it up to the penthouse from here. If I get closer, I can take him out. Take him out, Standish. Okay, now what? Enter your password. He sounds nervous. Maybe I should take him out.
Okay, all clear. Hope Standish is all right. Let's try this again. It's safe now. What were they after? Just financial records. About Devil's Breath? How do you know about that? Why do they want it? I don't even know what it is. Mr. Osborne's been pouring money into it for years, but he keeps the whole project a secret. I'm the only one who has any record of it. Not anymore. Looks like they copied some records to a secure server. Payroll information. On a Dr. Isaac Delaney. Who is he? I, I honestly don't know. Down! <laughs> Come on, come on! Wait, the elevator! <gasps> Hold on! Almost got him! Try to fall slower! You okay? Yeah. I think so. Good. Good. You know, as elevator shafts go, this is pretty nice. <laughs> hey, Yuri. You okay? Yeah. But I didn't get much out of Standish before these Sable guys stepped in and told me to back off. What's the deal? I get the sense all they care about is keeping him quiet. Because he knows about Devil's Breath. Right. Whatever the hell that is. I'm working on that. I think I just got a lead. A lead? You sound like a cop. Don't you mean... Spider Cop? Uh, Yuri? That's fair. He's safe. Okay, good. And the demons? They were looking for a name. You got a pen? Yeah, go. Dr. Isaac Delaney. Okay. Who is he? What's his deal? I was hoping you could tell me. I'm on it. Just give me a few. Oh, and before I forget, you left that tracker from Tombstones at my place. I'll drop it at Dr. Octavius's lab. Let you know what I find on Delaney. Attention agents, this is control. Need an update on the...
situation in Madison. APC under fire. Repeat, we are taking fire. Captain Watanabe gave me her cell number when she finally decided to trust me. She's risking a lot. If any... Sable aren't my biggest fan, but I can't let the demons kill him. I'm not with those guys, but I'm still gonna kick your butt! Message from Doc. Sorry to call so late. My mind's bursting with ideas. We've been thinking too small, Peter. Why replace missing limbs with facsimiles when we can improve upon them? People who've lost an arm understandably want it back, but we can give them something better. The human body doesn't need to be our default. We can go so far beyond it. Just some thoughts to conjure with. Doc's really giving it both barrels. Hope he doesn't burn himself out. Hey, do you have time to check something out for me? No, but if you ask nicely, just got a call about a suspicious looking box on a rooftop in Hell's Kitchen. I could call in the bomb squad, but if it's just some kid's science project... Yeah, I know, but these cameras aren't cheap. If Felicia's really strapped, why is she leaving them lying around? I love making you chase me, Spider. Someday I might even let you catch me. Just not today. There it is. Hey, Yuri. You were saying you wanted me to check something out? Just got a call about a suspicious looking box on a rooftop in Hell's Kitchen. I could call in the bomb squad, but if it's just some kid's science project. Yeah, I know. Budget crisis. Yada, yada, yada. So? Uh, will you please check it out? There's the magic word. I hope it's some kid's science project. Man, I miss those days. School projects are so much easier than real life projects. Hmm, looks military grade. Weird. Spider-Man, so you found one of my recon points. Who is this? Wrong question. The correct one is, can you stop the bombs I've planted? Mystery Man's got recon points spread all over the city. This computer's tracking bombs around the district, and they're about to go off. I gotta move. Can't let any of those bombs explode. Here goes the dynamite. Find the last bomb. <laughs> Not gonna lie, feeling pretty good about myself right now. Nice work with the bombs, but you lean into your throat too much. Hurts the accuracy. Is this some kind of sick game to you? Game 
Guns are for kids, and I'm a professional, and I get paid like it. Guess your client wasted their money. Sometimes information's worth more than money, and I've learned plenty watching you. MJ, what did you find out about Isaac Delaney? Check out the picture I just sent. Which one is Delaney? I don't know. Guess you'll have to go to the party to find out. Good thing I already have a costume. Hi! We can fight or, hear me out, we can barbecue! Risk out here. Better go in. Demons are down. I'll let you take it from here, officers. Hey, you guilty of that all those people who died in City Hall? Bad mojo, officer. Real bad. Join us in the shadows. Daily Bugle. Always a great paper. Even more now that Jameson's retired. Peter, I spoke to Miles' mother, and she loved the idea of him working here. The poor woman's grieving herself while trying to be strong for her son. She needs some time to just grieve. Call this guy an ambulance. He needs to Hope see they can help. Life still worth living. That was a very thoughtful suggestion, Peter. The kind that would have made Ben proud. Agents, this is Control. Need an update on the situation in Madison. Control, checkpoint under assault. It's the demons. Sable and demons. None of them like me. I can't let them kill each other. Time for my special brand of conflict resolution. Saving our butts, Spidey. You're welcome, scary fascist soldier guy. Save.
Halloween party. Guess I don't have to change. Delaney's dressed as one of my greatest foes. Let's find out which one. Everyone's in costume. My people. Now there's a guy who puts in the effort. Badass. That job offer in Delaware came through. Dr. Delaney is here somewhere. Hey, I have to find him before Lee does. Excuse me, are you Dr. Delaney? Ah, oh, Spider-Man, my nemesis. You won't catch me this time. Oh no, smoke. Whatever will I do? This is the end for you, Spider-Man. Now I have you! Hey, what's wrong with you? I worked on that helmet for a week. I need to find Dr. Delaney. He's out in the party somewhere. Who are you? I'm your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. <laughs> Smart ass. Guy throwing down candy could be Dr. Delaney. Gotta find a way up there. I'm looking for Isaac Delaney. I think he's on the dance floor. There he is. The lizard in the lab coat. Boy. Isn't someone of your nemesis's? We gotta uh, fight. Maybe later. Oh, what's the matter, Spider Whip? You afraid of my mighty horn? Hey, hey, who? What, what are you? Come on! Hey! Uh, fight! Uh, Take fight. his ass, Spider Man! What the hell? what you want this is a joke right those aren't real guns back now let him go Everybody okay? Yeah. Good. Uh, happy Halloween. How about some mood lighting?
And where'd they take Delaney? recently began working with someone in an Oscorp lab. How do, you, how do you know that? We don't have much time, Isaac. Tell me his name. Show's over, Lee! Apparently the show's not over. His name, Dr. Morgan Michaels. Thank you. That's all of them. Gotta find Lee.
Yuri, I need your help. I've got reports of shots fired at ESU. Yeah, that's me. I'll explain later. But right now, you need to find a Dr. Morgan Michaels. Martin Lee's coming after him. Copy that. Spider-Man, who is this Dr. Michaels? I think he's the head scientist on this Devil's Breath project. Did you find him? Yes and no. Sable says they have him under protection at a safe house somewhere in the city. But they won't tell me where. I thought you guys were working together. So did I. Okay. I have an idea on how to find him. I'll let you know if it works. Dr. Delaney at the party? Yeah, but so did Lee. Oh no, what happened? Lee corrupted him and made him kill himself. That's horrible. We have to stop this guy. We will. Before Delaney died, he gave Lee a name. Morgan Michaels. Morgan Michaels? Who is he? Not sure, but I bet he works on the Devil's Breath project. Have you learned anything from that Devil's Breath file? Yeah, get this. A few years ago, Osborne came to Fisk and asked him to build a lab, but to keep it hidden from regulators. Secret lab? For Devil's Breath? If it's as dangerous as we think it is, I can see why. Where's the lab? It's not in the file. Osborne made Fisk destroy all records of it. All I have are invoices from Osborne's personal account to Fisk Construction. Knowing Fisk, he kept the invoices around for blackmail material on the mayor. Everything leads back to Norman Osborne. I guess it's time to pay him a visit. I doubt he's gonna tell you anything. Wasn't planning to ask. Okay, that's how I can get into Norman's office. Can't get in there without shutting down some security systems. But if they see me, they'll put the whole place on lockdown. I should be able to hack into the security network modules from the outside. There are the network cables. I just need to follow them to the security module. There we go, a security module. Looks like there's four of these around the building. That should make things easier. What the hell? Security teams, call in. Sable Team Alpha standing by. Looks like an electrical problem. Copy that. Keep an eye on the exterior while we try to track down the issue. Just when I thought it would be easy. Exterior sweep. There's the second module. What? All agents, someone's taking control of one of our subsystems. Initiating Delta Protocol. Man, everybody's got drones these days. Fable teams, I need a status report. 
Exterior sweep negative. We are all clear. Still look like a software issue? We don't know. We're evaluating. Please maintain current alert level. Okay, just two more modules. Attention all Sable teams. There's a small possibility we have a trespasser on site. We're analyzing data now. Stay vigilant. Copy that, Control. There it is. Damn it. Another subsystem is going offline. I need a team to scan the 85th floor exterior. Copy, Control. Bird inbound. Gotta move. Hi, MJ. A little bit... Target spotted. It's Spider-Man! Gotta move. Hi, MJ. A little busy right now. I'll be quick. Listen, I got a lead on Charles Standish's location. I think if I can get to him, I can make him talk. He knew about Dr. Delaney. He probably knows about Morgan Michaels as well. Okay, just don't do anything crazy. Speaking of crazy, gotta find that last module. Gotta move. Hi, MJ. A little busy right now. I'll be quick. Listen, I got a lead on Charles Standish's location. I think if I can get to him, I can make him talk. He knew about Dr. Delaney. He probably knows about Morgan Michaels as well. Okay, just don't do anything crazy. Speaking of crazy, gotta find that last module. There's the last one. Nice. Now I can get into Norman's office and hopefully find out more about Morgan Michaels and Devil's Breath. Exterior sweep negative. Should we go on lockdown? Not yet. Mr. Osborne is in the middle of an important call, but keep tracking. There must be someone out there. Hold on. Switching to a secure line. I'm way ahead of you, Wilson. I had my people go through all your files. If you try to expose our business arrangement, it'll be your word against mine. And I'm not the one behind bars right now. Wait. Is Norman talking to Wilson Fisk? Neo statue. What are you talking about? The Neo statue from the auction house. They must be talking about that file MJ found. Who has the file? We do, Norman. But it doesn't tell us enough. Which is why I'm doing some slightly illegal, but morally acceptable B&E right now. Pompous son of a bitch! You're lying! Ah, oh, don't be too mad, Norman. We know you and Fisk built a secret Devil's Breath lab. But we still don't know where it is and what Michaels has to do with it. GR-27. Hmm. Dr. Morgan Michaels is the chief scientist, but the location of the lab is redacted. AI-controlled CRISPR? If that actually works, it could cure any genetic disease. Cystic fibrosis? Huntington's? This is crazy. Creepy. GR-27 is Devil's Breath. It's designed to cure diseases, but in its current form, it's like a bioweapon. Dr. Michaels keeps the only sample with him at all times. That's why Lee wants him. We find Michaels, we find Devil's Breath. MJ, get this. Devil's Breath wasn't designed to be a weapon. It's a treatment for genetic disorders. But its current form is wildly imperfect. In trying to fix the body, it rips it apart. We need to locate Dr. Michaels. I don't trust Sable to contain something this deadly. I may have a lead on that. 
Charles Standish is being held at Sable's Central Park compound. If anyone knows Michael's location, it'll be Oscorp CFO. I'm trying to reach him now. Reach him? That place is crawling with guards. How are you trying to reach him? Very, very quietly. Gotta go, partner. Sneaking into a Sable compound? That could go bad fast. I should head to Central Park. Ground teams, this is Control. Boss wants an update on the theater district. Over. Demons are firing on our APC. Looks like Doc checked in. Peter, I've had an epiphany. It's all about the mind. Take me, for example. A mind of unlimited potential, shackled to a tired, old body. Think of what that mind could achieve if it were freed. In developing our neural interface, we need to think beyond replicating the tired putterings of our physical forms. Instead, reach into imagination and possibility. Reach it. Where are you, MJ? Crap. Reach him? That place is crawling with guards. How are you trying to reach him? Very, very quietly. Gotta go, partner. Standish is somewhere in there. Gotta get past that guard. Time to see if these lores Pete gave me work. That gap in the fence looks promising. Just need to distract the guard. Out of the way. Gonna check on our house guest. Stay here. Copy. House guest. Must be Standish. He's here somewhere. Need to draw him away from the stairs. What the? What's that? Demons are killing anyone related to Devil's Breath. Standish is in real danger. Got it. Time to move. Standish. I knew it. I've got to get to that tent. <laughs> Standish is secure, ma'am. Lockout comms as well. I do not want leaks to press about Michael's or Devil's Breath. Crap. I won't distract him for long. units. He carries the only sample of Devil's Breath. I will not be responsible for pandemic. Understood, ma'am. I don't care how many men Sable has. She won't be able to stop Martin Lee.
Looks important. Safe houses. If Dr. Michaels is in one of these, Standish might know which one. Continuing sector sweep. There's Standish's tent. Can't believe Michaels just carries devil's breath around with him. Osborne doesn't trust anyone else to do Again? What's up with these lights? Charles Standish? Holy crap! Charles, where is Dr. Morgan Michaels? Lee sent you. Didn't he? No. Look. He wants to kill me? You tell him to do it. Do it himself. I'm not with the demons. I'm not with Sable. I'm a reporter. And I want to see Lee stopped. Just like you. Watson. I've heard your byline. Sable won't listen to me. She has Michaels in the Bowery. They're moving him to a new safe house tomorrow at noon. But she's totally ignoring Grand Central. Grand Central? The demons were talking about it when they held me. They're going there to get... To get what, Charles? What do the demons need to get at Grand Central? <laughs> what the... Oh, what that the was hell? not a Sable guy. Definitely not a Sable guy. Sorry, Charlie. Okay, time to Wait, go. No, he knows something. Well, that was maybe the most awkward swing of my life. MJ is not happy. Hey, okay, another thing. Sorry, Charlie. You knock a man out, destroy my background research, and the best you've got is sorry, Charlie? Is everything a joke to you? What? MJ, no, I, I screwed up. It, it was a tension breaker. Tension breaker, right. You know, this is exactly why we broke up. I thought we broke up so you could focus on your career. We broke up because you wouldn't stop treating me like a baby. Don't do this, MJ. Don't do that, MJ. Oh, that's too dangerous, MJ. I may not have super spider powers, but I'm not made out of glass. You snuck into the middle of an armed military... You know what? Can we not do this right now, please? Did you learn anything about Dr. Michaels? <sighs> Fine. <sighs> Michaels is in the Bowery somewhere. Sable's moving him tomorrow at noon. Awesome. Anything else? Was he saying something about Grand Central before I jumped in? He was... No. It was nothing. Listen, I gotta go, Peter. Filing deadline. Peter. That's how you know she's still mad. Peter. Nice work, Mr. Superhero. Man, I'm worked up. Gotta blow off some steam on patrol. Window, but I always get the feeling something strange is going on in that place.
Okay, I think I can finish listening to Doc's message. Peter, I've had an epiphany. It's all about the mind. Take me, for example. A mind of unlimited potential, shackled to a tired, old body. Think of what that mind could achieve if it were freed. In developing our neural interface, we need to think beyond replicating the tired putterings of our physical forms. Instead, reach into imagination and possibility. Reach into the mind. I've never heard Doc this excited by a project. Hope he's not too excited. Black Cat's been here. She was doing this in person the first time I caught her. Or did she catch me? This can't just be some elaborate flirtation. Hasn't she heard of dating apps? She's up to something. If you told 12-year-old me one day dudes in masks would try to blow them up with rockets, well, actually, you'd probably get pretty excited. Stable ground team. Need a status report. Well, Peter, I'm about to begin another test. Oh, sorry. My bus broke down and uh, there were no cabs, but I'll be there as soon as I can. Hey, sorry I'm late. Morning, Parker. Or is it evening? That doesn't matter. Check the neurosensors, would you? We need a faster response time. On it. Try to get it under three milliseconds. Okay, looks like I could optimize this power relay.
Nice. Okay, what next? Looks like some impedance in this neurosensor circuit. Finished. The signal to noise is out of whack. A new signal processor should reduce lag. I got it, Doc. 2.8 milliseconds. Good work, Peter. I'd call that a mild success. I'd call that unbelievable. Do you need some help? Yes. Doctor, what's going on? It's become that obvious. My doctors call it a degenerative neurological disorder. Probably caused by overexposure to toxic chemicals in my reckless youth. Sorry, is, is, is there anything I can do? You already are. The worst part is, it only affects the muscles. The mind continues to work, but... 
we can no longer do. You're the only one who knows, Peter. I'd like to keep it that way. Of course. Uh, if you'd like to seek a position with more of a future... I, I came here to work for you because of what you've got up here. And that's not going anywhere. So neither am I. Oh, Peter, before I forget, I read the most fascinating article. Outlines possible next steps for the neural interface. I'll take a look. Thanks, Doc. Doc loves these things. He used them in grad school when he had to manipulate radioactive isotopes. Says seeing them keeps him humble. What is this, Doc? Never seen this type of material. Would you believe it's for welding? Provides remarkable magnetic insulation and limits cross-contamination between the neural interface and arms. Man, direct interface with the basal ganglia. Exciting, but risky. I don't know, Doc. You'll need a gallium silk array to make it work. Even then, odds of injury are pretty high. Gallium! Genius! Never mind the risks. We'll work them out in time. Doc's really sick. At this rate, he'll lose control of his motor functions within a year. And if we're not careful, an intracranial implant could make things even worse. Even alter his personality. We need to proceed carefully. Peter is starting to suspect. He hides it, but I can tell. He's seen my twitch, noticed the decay of my fine motor control. Well, I'm the one who wanted a genius for an assistant. Of course he knows. <sighs> I just need more time. My work can improve millions of lives. Save millions of lives. It can also save my own. I just need more time. Hmm. Um, Doc, I'm sorry, my... Ant just texted. No worries, Peter. I was thinking of taking a break myself. As soon as I check our telemetry data. Thanks. I'll be back in a few hours. Hi, May. Let me guess. Running late? Nope, I'm actually on my way now. Have you heard from Miles? No, but his mother said he was coming, so... Good. I'll be there soon. Bye! doing here you just made your last mistake punk what the 
Does it seriously take this many guys to rob a teenager? Spider-Man. You're the amazing Spider-Man. You're the spectacular Spider-Man. And a few other choice adjectives Jameson uses. Look, that was really brave. But next time, leave the fighting to the pros. Okay? Uh, okay, but what if there aren't any around? Well, you can't just go swinging at someone twice your size. I mean, don't get me wrong. I fight guys stronger than me all the time. But when I do it, I have... Oh, like that time you fought Ryan on the Brooklyn Bridge? That was so awesome. Perfect example. If the other guy's bigger, you gotta be quicker. Okay? Okay, but that's it's easy for you to say. I, sorry, I just can't do what you do. All right, put him up. Seriously? Yeah, come on. First thing, don't let the adrenaline get to you. Breathe slow, breathe deep, relax. Hip square to your opponent. Let them make the first move. Now use your feet, and when they go off balance, look for an opening. Boom. Like that? Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Not only this time, just let me have it. Right on the jock. Okay? I can do it. <clears throat> oh, sh... S sorry No, no. No. It's all good. <laughs> you keep that up, and uh, you'll be fine. All right. Lesson's over. Gotta go. Hey, uh... Thanks. You know... Anytime. I just punched Spider Man. Shelter should be just ahead. Yo, Miles, what's up? Bro, you're not gonna believe this. I just met Spider Man. What? That's crazy. Hey, did you show him our hacking app? Oh, man. I totally forgot. Oh, you suck. He totally would have bought it off you, and then we'd be, like, famous. Yeah, I'll show him next time. I, I gotta go. I promised my mom I wouldn't be late. Uh, cool. Later. Keep moving. Keep moving. Right. Farmer's market. I can cut... Well, when you say it like that, how would you say it? Tourism? Huh. Hacking app. I wonder if it still works. Uh-oh. Everyone have their IDs out, ready for inspection. Are you kidding me? It's gonna take forever. The drone wasn't watching. I could jump the fence. You just need to isolate the drone signal. Wow! That was too easy! Have you seen I can't him? believe no. Sable systems are unsecure. Maybe I'll send an anonymous tip. Okay, hacking app. Don't fail me now. Maybe I could turn on that siren. <clears throat> okay, let's see. I can go under the gate on the left, or over the scaffolding to the right. You're lying. We have footage. Come on, man. I just gotta go home. I have the authority okay. to arrest and detain you. Stay calm. I gotta distract him. I've been getting a lot of calls about this Sable International outfit that's assisting police with the search for suspects in the city hall lot. I've got Ken on line three with some thoughts. Ken, you're on with J. Jonah James. First of all, I just want to say it's an honor to be on your show. Thank you, Ken. You just earned yourself a... Okay, 
I'm in the clear. Phew. That was intense. Oh, hey, Mom. Hi, honey. Did you make it to the thief shelter okay? Uh, yeah, almost there. Miles, you don't have to work at that shelter, you know. You said I did. No, I gave you a choice. Yeah, and I chose this over more therapy. I mean, it was helpful. The guy said everyone grieves in their own way. But this is mine. Okay. Sorry. Mom. Yeah? Just because I don't want to talk about it doesn't mean I don't love you. Oh, honey. I love you so much. We'll get through this. Okay? I gotta go. I'll call you on my way home. Hey, hey, Miles. Pete. Hey, um, sorry I'm late, man. Oh, no, no, I'm just glad you're here. All right, so, um, what can I do to help? Why don't you start just by, uh, getting comfortable with the place. Uh, meet a few people. You know what? Everybody loves coffee. Coffee? All right. And I'll be back in a little while to check on you. Is that cool? Yeah. Oh, don't worry about Mr. Hodges. He doesn't bite. Much. You sure? Coffee? Thanks. Need help? Not unless you know what the hell a quark is. It's a subatomic particle. You know, the building block of protons, neutrons, hadrons? Subatomic? It fits. Good one, kid. Piece of junk. <laughs> oh, hell. Damn hunk of junk. Uh, you mind if I take a look? Eh? Oh, we have a couple of CRTs at school. I know how to fix these CR when they're... CR what, what? No, no, you just gotta smack it. Couple times. Get it. Go! Or, could be a loose coax cable. <sighs> all right, all right. Be my guest, huh, Mr. Smarty Pants? Hey, please, go ahead. Tributes continue to pour in for Officer Jefferson Davis, the hero killed in the City Hall bombing, as reports emerge that he used his own body to shield others in his last moments of life. Hey, hey new kid. I'm empty here. Rio and son Miles, as well as brother Aaron. In addition to the hero. Man didn't do nothing heroic except get himself blown up. Hey, Ernie. I see you've met Miles. He's gonna be helping out around here. You may have heard of his father, Jefferson Davis. Pretty great that even though he's got a lot of stuff going on right now, he decided to come and volunteer. Don't you think? Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Thanks. Uh, listen, Cat, I'm, I'm... Sorry about your dad. Come on, Miles. Let's see if Ant-Man needs a hand in the kitchen. Hey, May. I gotta take off, but, uh, brought some help for you. Hi, Miles. Nice to see you. Well, grab an apron, wash your hands, and I'll show you around. Hey, hey Peter. Um, thanks for that back there. Of course. Almost noon. Sable should be moving Dr. Michaels. Better get to the Bowery and locate him. I'm afraid our computers are a bit outdated. Oh, that's cool. I might be able to improve their performance for you. Really? Way to have the kids back. I'm heading to the Bowery to make sure Michaels gets to his new safe house. You know, safely. I wouldn't do that. Silver Sable made it clear you are not welcome. Yeah, well, what's she gonna do?
shoot me? Honestly, 50-50 chance. Ah, fine. I'll be in the neighborhood, but not too close. Just in case. Two cars. Plus a bomb rig to explode. Need to stop them. Okay, be straight with me. Get this. Here's your stuff. Literally didn't see that coming. Can't have the ones inside feeling left out. Going down. MJ, I'm at the first location on your list. And guess what I found? Demons? Give the lady a prize. See if you can figure out what they're up to while I introduce myself. Don't 
for Chinatown shops. What they're importing is not something I want as a memento. Drugs? Demons. Looks like they bring in their buddies in shipping containers. Explains how foreign nationals with criminal records are getting into the country. MJ, call the police. All the demons are incapacitated. Don't forget to bring me a souvenir.
the Bowery, but where's Dr. Michaels? We're ready for you, Dr. Michaels. Is that the Devil's Breath? It's called GR-27, not... <sighs> Just be careful. In the wrong hands, this could... Don't worry. We're the best in the world. <sighs> I feel better already. Code 381. Package is on the move. This way, Dr. Michaels. What the hell is that? Welcome aboard, Doctor. Get off me! We got this! Yeah, sure you do. I'm in pursuit of Martin Lee. I think he's got Dr. Michaels and the Devil's Breath. Copy that. Four units coming your way. He took Michaels alive, so that's good. Probably so we can force him to make more Devil's Breath. I have to stop that truck. Tank. Whatever. Clear the guys in the trucks before I go after Lee. and he will destroy all sinners! Sorry! Lee, hand it over! What are you 
doing to me? Giving you a new perspective. What the hell? I must be honest. I was hoping to bring you here. My abilities lend me a certain persuasiveness. I've been watching you. I was waiting for you at City Hall. You never came. Where were you? Is this real or in my mind? It was a shame so many had to die with no heroes to save them. That officer saved your life, didn't he? He was here because of you. And Norman wanted to use him. A futile gesture in the end. And where was Norman during all this? Slinking away like a rat. He knew what was going to happen, and he fled. Norman is a hidden cancer on this city. He must be excised with no trace of his corruption to return. Norman hides behind his mask of lies. I will break it apart and drag him into the light. Put on the mask. Become one of us. Thanks, but no thanks! <sighs> One way or the other, you will join me! Uh-oh. All the souls you've lost! The innocent victims you couldn't save! Martin, their blood is on your hands! You can stop Osborne. You have so much strength. I can give you will. Filled the gutters, and you did nothing! I can't save everyone! What's one life? A simple trade. One life for a city of souls. You defend Osborne while he sits in his ivory tower? This isn't real! Show me your true strength! Heal before me! I will throw your mask off and expose you! The shadows are sworn to me! I will give them strength! Mask. What? I'm going to destroy the mask! I won't abandon you in the darkness, Martin! I will break you and leave you brain dead! You can't! You can come back to the light! No! You okay? Did they take it? Yes. How worried should I be? Very. You're a popular guy. Where is this serum? I'm gone. To destroy you. So-called superhero. You think you save people, but you just make it worse. This is your fault. My fault? He was under your protection. You really need two of those? Uh, 
Stop! We need to brief Mr. Osborne now. I'll go with her. Thank you. I'll remember this. Yuri, tell me you've got a lead on Martin Lee's location. We have footage from a guy at a coffee shop. Looks like he hopped into a black sedan after the crash. Black sedan, great. Let me finish. We have a partial plate. And one of my patrol guys just found a matching plate. Black sedan in a parking lot near Canal and Hudson. You're a good cop, Yuri. I'm on my way. Spider-Man. Hello? Is this working? Dr. Michaels? How are you calling? Borrowed on one of Sable's radios. Listen, transit hubs are the most likely release points for Devil's Breath. Airports, bus terminals, train stations. It'll spread like wildfire from there. Why the hell is Oscorp developing a bioweapon in the city? Shouldn't this be in an Arctic bunker? Devil's Breath is personal for Norman. It's been his obsession for decades. The project breaks every state and federal regulation on the books, but he doesn't care. If the city finds out, he can kiss re-election goodbye. Never mind re-election. He'd be tried in The Hague for war crimes. Why are you telling me all this? Aren't you just as culpable as Norman? Yes. Completely. But Lee's actions have been a wake-up call. We've ignored the project's risk for too long. I trust you, Spider-Man. You're the only one trying to do the right thing. Please, protect the city from our mistakes. Fly away, please! It is my responsibility to catch that pigeon. I can't believe I said that. The cat? Talk less word. Parker, I wanted to thank you. Your work on the neural interface has been invaluable. I wish you could see what that means right now. But it's beginning to dawn on me just how powerful and insidious the forces arrayed against true visionaries are. I promise you, though, it won't be long. Success will come, whatever it takes. Powerful and insidious forces? I don't like the sound of that. Need to check on Doc when I get a chance. Caught a sniper stalking Mayor Osborne's chief of staff. Pretty sure there are other targets. Our perp had a map of the city with the courthouse circled. I'm on it. See if you can get more info out of our friend here and contact me at this number. I need to hurry. The attack on the courthouse could come any second. Sniper sees me near the target. He'll take the shot. Only chance is to take out the gunman before he can fire. Shh. Nobody likes a camper. Spider-Man! We accessed the perp's phone. Found more names and locations. Looks like it's all going down. within a matter of minutes. No pressure, send me what you got. Multiple snipers, one Spider-Man. I need to move fast. Anyone who's ever worked on Norman's campaign is a potential target. That's one way to destroy Osborne, I guess. Make it so nobody wants to be around him. Sniper's gotta be around here somewhere. Sweet dreams. One down, two to go. Gotta check out all possible vantage points for snipers. Lady Knight. Target safe. Only one to go. 
If I'm too slow, people die. Why can't assassins ever try and work around my schedule? This is the place. Now where's the assassin? I'm snoring now. Just in time. Officer, all three snipers are down. Are we in the clear? Not quite. Our perp says his boys are holding a bunch of tourists hostage. He says they'll execute them all if we don't let them go. We have a probable location based on cell phone towers. But if they see cops, they'll start shooting. Act like you're negotiating. Stall them. I'll take away their bargaining chips. They won't leave witnesses. Either I save the hostages, or they're dead. Someone needs a nap. Thanks again, Spider-Man. This could have turned ugly. I wouldn't have known about it if not for you. We make a good team, officer. Hey, see if you can convince more of your buddies to work with me instead of shooting at me, okay?
got my Halloween costume all set. Spider-Man. And then he goes and changes his. I'm like, dude, you say hi to my kid? Damn. Devil's breath is gone. I should call MJ and Warner. This is Mary Jane Watson. Please leave a detailed message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. What are you up to now, MJ? Sanders said the demons are looking for something at GCT. But what could they possibly need here? Should probably call Peter and let him know what I'm doing. Actually, scratch that. He'd probably just tell me to go home and chain myself to my laptop. I'll just check things out quick and let him know what I find. From paper cuts to gunshot wounds, Oscorp's patented nanotechnology can increase the body's heating rate by 1,000 times. We're not just saving you money. We're saving lives. Oscorp's research and development team are hard at work on a radical new form of battery that recharges itself from sound waves. In a few short months, you will be able to buy a phone that will never have to be plugged in. Oscorp's revolutionary cool. medical evacuation drone, or MED, offers immediate emergency assistance, even in the most hostile areas of the world. Stay green and use the appropriate recycle bins when disposing of your waste items. Encrypt your data with Oscorp Cerberus Cipher, the world's only mathematically proven unbreakable encryption algorithm. Oscorp's patented array of intelligent, sensor-equipped munitions has reduced accidental casualties on the battlefield by over 94%. <sighs> if you see any suspicious activity, please report it to the nearest security My turn. team member. Oscorp's revolutionary bioenhancer, <laughs> Focus. Strengthens your body's oh own nervous system, allowing you to Let stay awake and active for over it'll show anything. This Gaia microbe dispersal device releases specially formulated microbes into the atmosphere, and in turn, leaves our oceans and rivers cleaner than when man first walked. Mr. Lee. This will be easier for everyone if you remain calm and do as I say. Police! Over here! No! Office. I would like to speak to Mayor Osborne. Who's calling? The man he is looking for. What do you want? I want you at Grand Central Terminal in 30 minutes. By yourself. Or there'll be more blood on your hands. I should be on the lookout for. 
Please, don't hurt us. Where the hell is... Looks like he's got some drones patrolling. Guess he's prepared for you. Don't worry, I'm in the ventilation system. Can you see a safe exit point? Southwest corner. On my way. If I get any closer, the drones will spot me. See that tablet I'm looking at? That controls the drones. Think you can snag it? Yes. If you can distract them. And not get shot. I'm ready. Tell me when. Okay. I'm ready. Incoming. Listen, I'm a reporter. I have a direct line to Mayor Osborne. I can help make sure he arrives. On time. How? First, let him go. Good job. Now let's get you out of here. What about the Devil's Breath? I'll come back for it. No. We're partners, remember? Can we argue later? If we don't help those people, they could die. So could you. I can't let that happen. No. No, I got myself into this. I'm getting myself out. What do you mean you got yourself into this? I don't like this. There's too many of them. Then let's start taking them out. Not exactly. What do you mean? I thought something might happen, but not like this. Why didn't you tell me? I thought we were partners. Hey, partners trust each other, Peter. What do you mean? I trust you? Yeah, when I'm sitting at home behind a laptop. Oh, come on. Can we please get back to saving the city here?
take him out. Do it. Nigga, Jesus, I gnarly. Start the timer. Keep him busy. I'll take care of the devil's breath. You know what you're doing? No. That's never stopped me before. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. Looks like the blue is connected to the battery, and yellow to a fan. Red one has a little exclamation mark. Okay. You'll want to detach the wires from the battery first. Trace the wires to the other end and unplug them from there. Okay. Unplug the wires from the battery. the first wire. Now the second one. The other battery wire. What? The timer just changed to 30 seconds. Ah, it's a collapsing circuit. What comes next? The fan? Yes, then the last wire. But you have to hurry. these people out of here. I could use a little Spidey help. You ready? Right. I'll clear a path. Try to do it quietly. Will do. New York. Need to take out a few more. Then it'll be safe for you to move. Hurry.
Okay, MJ, time to go. Copy that. Everyone, follow me! MJ, did you make it out? Yeah, everyone's safe. Good job. Hey, Peter. Yeah? When you're done in there, we should talk. Yeah, we should. But first, find me and kick his ass. I feel bad for anyone who's on the wrong side of MJ. Wonder what side I'm on right now. Okay, guys, trivia time. Did you know Grand Central has the largest basement in New York City? Crazy, right? You can fit half the Brooklyn Bridge down there. Ha! Ah, I agree. You sure don't make them like they used to. That's old school New York gunship for you. Anyway, I could talk trivia all day, but I gotta stop your wing nut of a boss. His escape plan is to use the train. Can't let him get away. Train platform is open. That must be where Lee is. Train's moving. Lee's getting away. Finally. Sorry I'm late. It's kind of my thing. Are you doing this? Paying off an old debt. Better keep my distance for now. Didn't work. Better wait for an opening. His guard's down. Looks like he's getting tired.
want to hurt you! Nothing can hurt me! Not anymore! No brakes? No problem. That totally worked last time. Yuri, they still doing construction on 42nd and 1st? Streets closed for another month. Why? <laughs> Next stop, prison. Jane Watson, please leave a detailed message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Uh, hey, it's me. Let me know when you want to talk. Texting isn't talking? No, 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 not that kind of over! Please say no. Huh. Okay, okay. And not okay. What is there to figure out? Oh, you think? safe with Sable. How do you feel? How do I feel? How much time do you have? Not much. Heroics for you means paperwork for me. But I just wanted to say, good job. Thanks, Yuri. I kind of needed that. All this time with Lee, I've been ignoring the city. Time to get back to being a friendly neighborhood Spidey.